filming. And I'm going to home it. You can feel free to talk if that's I'm a narrative. I'm going to the video, but I'm home in the machine right now. So it's a... this is what size you... nozzle do you have on it's there? It's only a 30 amp in there right now. It'll do a 260. It'll do a 260 yeah, amp, but you have a 30 count. amp nozzle in there right now? Yeah, this is more for smaller materials. And this has automatic height control, correct? Oh, yeah. Has all the good features? All the good features. I'm going to reline the plate. In there, you can put it in there at least. I'm going to take it. I'm going to line my plate up turn it on. Do a three point to the bottom right. Done. Now let's try another way around. This is what I like about this machine. Got a little laser pointer, though. Oh, yeah. So that you really like the laser pointer because it tells like you where it's at. It makes it where I don't have to worry about where I'm hitting. Yeah, I'm oh hitting. yeah, that's that's, so that's I'm cool. Come back to you a little bit and make the mark. Oh wow, very cool. So that allows you to home it in and know where you're yeah. at. Now I gave it a three point setting, so all I'm going to do is hit this button over here. It's going to tell me uh, done and go to quarter. It's going to go over here to quarter where I believe my quarter should be. Yeah. I'm on auto mode right now. I'm going to go ahead and do a dry run just for the fun of it. This will be the laser only. Oh, so you'll just oh, see the I laser got, moving. Yeah, I got to load my program. I forgot I shut this thing all the way down. Let me get it back up. 30 amps. So I'm picking all my material parts right now as far as the thickness of the material right here. And my gun size right here. And I'll select it. It should show you right here. It shows you all your consumables right here on the screen which is kind of cool that shows you all your consumables so you know what your gun is being built at which is a good thing our new table doesn't seem to show that which i'm not overly impressed with i need to see if that's 30 amp right there 30 amp 30 amp apply now i'm going to pick a program which i had one and i like i said i shut it all down find the same program so it's just a folder system it's this like, is the folder it's yeah. just like Microsoft real similar yes and I'm not finding the folder I wanted so I'm gonna back back up I should have left it running but I didn't employee projects there it is there's the one I just employee projects there's the one I just did right there this will be it we're gonna load it we're gonna apply that 30 amp gun to it Everything should be a 30 amp gun. We're going to turn the power source on. Power supply. Looks like you've run this machine a lot. Oh, uh, yeah. I was one of the first ones that went to the store when we bought this over in Chicago. Oh, uh -huh. yeah, we bought. We had them build this for us. So it's a unique size, unique gun. It's going to go back to run screen. I'm on, hold, I'm on dry run. So what we're going to see is the laser is going to go over all the, all the circuits. Okay. okay. And what I like about this is when the dry run, I can turn this up to 1200 inches per minute, so it should do it pretty fast. So it's showing me that it's going to clear there, which is what I was concerned about. It looks like it's going to clear just fine. So you would nest whole plates apart? Oh, yes. Right? Yeah, you can nest as big as the table ahead and have a pretty good size. So that's done. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to hit stop and return to start. Return to start, yes. Now it should go back to there. I'm going to go into full mode, fire mode. It automatically changed my feet per second back down to, or inches per minute down to what it should be instead of full power. Here we go. This should fire and make that little part. You said this is 16 gauge? Mild steel. like a nice machine. We just put about four grand and just put some on these bits. So we got a brand new torch, brand new whip, uh, a whole bunch of vacuum uh, relays and everything. So they changed a bunch of parts in it. It's a circle. And I, I wanted to fix it. And so that's what we, we did. Yeah. Yeah.
more than that. You take care of it. Well, this is good. Uh, I'm glad you're letting me see this. This is good. Thank you for doing this. Wow. Very exciting.